Texas and Louisiana residents evacuated flood zones on Tuesday as Hurricane Laura barreled towards the coastline after earlier causing 25 deaths in the Caribbean. The storm's maximum sustained winds were nearing 150 kilometers an hour. The U.S. National Hurricane Center and forecasters expect it to strengthen significantly in the next 24 hours. It is forecast to reach the Texas or Louisiana coast on Wednesday night. Storm surges could reach up to four meters in places and are expected to be accompanied by large and destructive waves. They're going around picking up people who do not have transportation or who need a ride. We're getting them here, we're registering them, and then we're getting them on uh, coach buses to take them to somewhere safe. We've changed a little bit since it's been a pandemic because we've actually had to go into COVID and where people that come in, they get their um, hand spray with sanitizer, they're having their temperature checks, and they were also spacing everybody in six foot distancing. So they can bring like two bags and we also have pets out here. So what we're doing, uh, we have a special place that we sit people that have pets and their pets are stored back here. When we, we will put all the same people, pet people on a bus and their pets get to go with them. 